Hey, what's going on, Hollywire? This is Cameron Poise. Do not forget to subscribe. What's up, Hollywire? Thanks so much for tuning in today. I'm joined with the amazing Cameron Boyce. Cameron, tell everyone. thanks for coming on. Yeah, thanks for having me. Yeah, of course. So first and foremost, I want you to tell me about this little shirt. Yes, wearing. the little shirt. <laughs> The shirt of the hour. Tell me all about that. What's going on? So this is my collaboration that I did with First Project. It is my design. It is my words. That's my signature there. So it's pretty cool. I'm really <laughs> proud of it. Um, I'm happy we got to do it. And um, it is my second campaign with them. Mm -hmm. So every shirt, $25. Mm -hmm. And that $25 equals essentially saving a life. Um, okay. And what it is, is you are providing clean, safe drinking water for one person for the rest of their life. Buy a shirt. Buy a shirt, guys. <laughs> Buy a he shirt, y'all. Yeah. $25, Buy a we don't shirt. have that. That's yes. awesome, that's yes. so amazing. And yeah. what makes you like passionate about this project? It literally changes lives mm -hmm. um, in places that, um, are you know third world countries yeah. and people are really affected by it and it really makes a significant impact on people's lives so um, that's the short story of why I'm passionate. How about could you it. not be passionate about it? Yeah, it's it's and when I tell people about it, they don't know. Like that's yeah. the most incredible thing to me. Yeah, is like when I just spit out a few facts. They go, oh, I need to get involved with that. Like it's so simple. Right. Um. So you know, there are so many issues, but this one is so basic. It's something that we need to fix mm -hmm. and can fix in yeah. our lifetime. So we're on a new season of Descendants. Tell me yeah. what's going on there. Any spoilers? Oh you can gosh. Give me? Yeah. So the new movie. So it's it's the third movie now. Yeah. It's it's insane. Um, it's been five years That's and uh, yeah, it's gone by quickly and also gone by really slowly yeah. at the same time, if that makes any sense. Um, but no, we've we've just sort of gotten really close mm -hmm. and Descendants is so much more about the people who I'm surrounded by mm -hmm. than the actual thing, even yeah. though the actual thing is popular and right. a global, you know, sensation. So it's cool. it's so much more about the people that I've met and then also the people that we touch. Yeah. Um, and it's just been a, an incredible experience that um, I could have never really imagined, you know, if you had told me a year before I booked Descendants that it was gonna have an impact on the world, yeah. literally. Um, I would have been like, uh, <laughs> you're, <laughs> you're wrong. Um, but yeah, it's it's a really cool thing to get to be a part of and it's helped me travel, it's helped me yeah. you know, form relationships mm -hmm. and um, everything that you go through in life makes you a different person and this was definitely one of them. It was a big transformation. Yeah, it was a big transformation and um, a story that, you know, when kids watch it, um, and when they watch it with their parents, I think the parents understand that the message is actually a little more sophisticated yeah. than um, some it of the is. kids might really process at the time. Right. Um, and then when they get a little older, they think about it and they go, oh wow, that was, yeah. And I think actually in the third one, in the second one as well, but in the third one especially, um, we, I think, make political statements. Like there's, there's some really, um, there's some interesting stuff that okay. we sort of bring together, you know. There's stuff going on in our world now, and there's stuff going on in the Descendants world, um, but they mirror each other a little bit, and I'm really proud to be able to present that to kids in a way where they can understand it, yeah. if that makes any sense. Super cool, yeah. educational and entertaining. That's yeah, yeah, bright That's colors, great. a lot of dancing, but there's <laughs> also, a message nonetheless. Political statements. And really yeah, I mean, judge for yourself, but I felt that it was, uh, a pretty sophisticated message okay. for kids. Yeah. Well, I'm excited to see. That's really yeah. cool. Yeah. And I saw that you have a little bit of a love-hate relationship with social media, especially yeah. after being hacked. That was stressful, man. Just okay. because it's here's the thing: like, social media is such a big part of our society, mm -hmm. and it is the fabric of our society. Yep. Essentially, it's sort of what binds us. True. Um, but everything on social media is curated, and you're sort of presenting your best version of yeah, yourself. Your highlights. Or sometimes you're venting, and it's an outlet of like this hate that's being spewed onto mm -hmm. everybody. Um, so social media is yes, it's a tool for our careers, for bringing us all together, and sort of a place where you can get news and things like that. Right. But um, so many people use it uh, where it turns into a place of toxic energy and 
I find myself like throwing my phone away oh. and my friends are like, why aren't you texting me back? And it's like, because I don't want to look at Instagram. Can't deal with this You right know now. what I mean? Yeah. yeah, yeah. Like you get the notifications yep. and you're just like, I don't want to, right? Um, so yeah, it's, it is what it is about the hacking and all that stuff. Um, but I've always sort of been a little reluctant to, um, I don't know, rely on it for entertainment and things That's like good. that. That's sort of, yeah, it is good. It's good. But like at the same time, you know, it's, there are good things about it as well. And I do use it and I yeah. post a lot. So okay. it's a, it's up in the air. Fair enough. Love yeah. hate relationship. Yeah. You need it, That's but you what hate it. it. Right. Yeah. I, that's right. how I feel about men. So it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> hey, stick in there. Did you get your stick accounts back? Yeah, I got, so I got my Instagram back. That okay. was, I, it got hacked twice in a matter of two weeks. Yeah. And you need to. my password wasn't password, by the way. Like it wasn't like sure? Cameron no, Boyce sure. one, two, three. Like it was very complicated. So I don't know how they did it, but, um, did they do anything? They uh, tried to like sell iPhones or oh, something. Some the scam. Most thing I've that, ever it heard. was really weird. Like you would think. I don't want to give them any ideas, but like you'd think they'd do something a little yeah. more controversial than just like trying to sell iPhones. Cameron boys trying to sell some iPhones. Yeah, like, and people. <laughs> my friends all texted me sarcastically, like, "Hey man, where's my iPhone, dude?" I'm like you know, I'm not getting you an iPhone. I, was like, what are you I didn't about? even have the iPhone 10. <laughs> I was like, I'm not selling iPhone 10. You're like, well, I guess I'll buy it for my hackers. Yeah, Sounds good. seriously. That's really I need funny. One. <laughs> okay, so now we're gonna play a little game. All right, let's we're see. gonna play a game of word association. So, okay. I'm gonna say a word, and you're gonna say the very first thing that pops into your head. First word, banana. Apple. Oh, okay. Dove. Cameron. <laughs> Disney. Channel. Kate. Middleton? <laughs> <laughs> no, you're supposed to say DeRocher. Oh, sorry, 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 sorry. <laughs> Kool-Aid. Red. <laughs> Llama. Peru. <laughs> oh, that's good. Okay, Hollywire. Holly Weird. <laughs> uh, Justin Bieber. I just thought of Biebs. See, those were good answers. You were right. fast. I love it. I it, tried. I tried. It, it was impressive. It was yeah. very impressive. All right, well, thank you so much for coming on. Thank it was great talking me. to you. Yeah. You guys, thanks so much for watching Hollywire. Be sure to like, click, and subscribe, and we'll see you guys here next time.